Hi. In this video, I'm going to show you how to uh, change the color of your video uh, using Adobe uh, Premiere Pro's color correction tool. Um, given you're interested in editing area, maybe either the whole video, or if you have a video that that is, for instance, 10 minutes long, and you're just interested in editing one minute of it, or just you are interested in editing uh, some parts of a section of your video like features on the face, uh, like lips, uh, the eyes, or colors of the nail, and, and anything that is more small scale, I think this video might be a problem. So now, um, I've already selected my video here, you can do it uh, by choosing import button, or alternatively drag and drop it in the project area. Once done that, let's uh, put it on the timeline. I'm, I'll be working more in the section of the uh, eyes and the nails in this video. Adding until here, it's okay. And now let's uh, create a layer. This is an important part because uh, without having adjustment layer, you, you cannot focus on one particular zone. I'm going to be choosing um, color correction tool on uh, effects, video effects. Let's opt for color correction and three way color correction. And in general, in video, um, color correction encompasses adjusting both the hue, which is color and chroma, and luminance, that is brightness and, and contrast. Um, so when it comes to adjusting the color and luminance in video clips, you can create a mood, a limited color casting clip, correct video that it's too dark or too light, or set the levels to, to meet your requirements, to the broadcast requirements, or to match color from scene to scene. So effects can also adjust the color and luminance to emphasize or de-emphasize a detail in the clip. Uh, so color correcting is not just specifically focused on one particular area by the way so now let's um, drag and drop the trivial color character in the adjustment layer I just created and so now let's work with the secondary color correction um, we need to uh, use uh, uh, one of our, our uh, eye, eye droppers here uh, to select the uh, uh, the zone, the, the zone you're interested in. In this case, it is the iris of the eye. So I've selected that one. And um, the other two types of eyedroppers also can be used if uh, your selected area is, uh, for example, uh, uh, kind of um, um, too much or you have some unwanted areas that you need to uh, remove them so as to just uh, limit uh, your selected area into a uh, very uh, small zone you need to use the other eyedropper uh, the one that has a minus uh, in it and another thing that I need to mention is that you, you can also use the hue, saturation and luma in order to uh, increase or decrease uh, your selected area for color editing and they are very useful actually because you cannot uh, only use um, uh, you know uh, the eye eyedropper
In just two steps, I get what I want.